yeah, yeah. And then we sleep through day, then we play all through the late night. Sleep through day, then we play all through the late night. What is going on friends? Hope you guys are having a great day. Guys, I have changed locations once again. I'm back in Hollywood. The place that I was in yesterday's video was in Santa Monica. I came back here just so I'm closer to everything because Tico is actually coming here tomorrow. We're going to be staying together and we want to be doing like a bunch of stuff together going out in Hollywood. I actually haven't even seen Tico in like probably like almost two months now. I'm telling you guys, if you have never tried a caramel macchiato, you need to go to Starbucks right now. Don't even watch the end of this video. You need to go to Starbucks right now and get one. Come back and then watch this video because I'm telling you, it is life changing. But yeah guys, today is going to be awesome. I'm going to the Lakers game later on today with Attach and Gordy. I don't know if you guys know who Gordy is, but he's basically the person who helps a bunch of us with our YouTube channels. If you have any problems, this, that, he always knows how to figure it out. I want to give a quick shout out to SeatGeek for hooking me up with these tickets. They gave me three really, really good tickets, so I'm going to be going to the game with them later on today. But yeah guys, I need to go shower and get ready and then I need to go somehow find a way to get these tickets printed because this place doesn't have a printer and uh, I'm not sure where I can get a printer around me. So I need to go and probably hit Staples up or something like that just to get these tickets printed. But yeah guys, before I go ahead and start my day, I want to give you guys a little apartment tour of this place that me and Tika are going to be staying. It's honestly really, really nice. The only weird thing is, guys, look at this. I came in and I realized that there's a piece of wood on this couch and this couch is literally broken. Like you cannot sit on this couch. Like look how welcoming and comfortable this couch looks. Like I would honestly sleep on this couch but I can't because the leg is broken. This leg right here. But yeah guys, the first thing you see when you walk into the apartment is a massive like living area and then the kitchen and stuff. Honestly, it's a pretty, pretty big um, apartment. And then if you take a left over here, you have like a little dining area. Let me try to turn on a light. Why is there a switch on the ceiling? What does this do? Imagine I turn it on and the whole building just collapsed. That would be terrible. Alrighty friends, so I finally made it to Staples and guys check it out got the tickets printed I'm gonna be heading to the Staples Center at 730 to watch this Lakers versus Nets game pretty excited I'm in some part of Hollywood right now But there's always some movies or something just being shot everywhere in Hollywood right there as you can see There's like a movie set or something going on. I need to tell you guys something I got this Airbnb and in the description, it literally said high-speed internet That's literally something I made sure of because I need to upload videos and stuff like that and I come here and the internet right here is literally the worst internet I've ever seen in my life. It's so bad. YouTube videos, I literally came and watched them. They like, what is that noise? It sounds like the ceiling is about to fall. But guys, like I said, YouTube videos literally load at 144p. Do you know how bad that is? It's literally pixels. I can't even see what YouTuber I'm watching. This, that. I'm in a Skype call right now and my voice sounds like a robot. I can't even talk in the Skype call. I can't even watch people's screens, this, that. It's just a huge hassle. I don't understand how high speed internet means no internet at all because that's literally, I might as well just have no internet at this point. Banks just messaged me right now asking if I can get on Skype to make a thumbnail for him for his new video that's going up, but I literally can't because of how bad the internet is. I cannot load Skype. I can't even get on. It just like puts me offline right away. I'm not even gonna be able to send or accept the file, so. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I need to try to figure this out. Alrighty, friends, so I'm just gonna update the vlog. I am ready, I'm good to go. I'm about to head over to the Staples Center to go watch the Lakers versus the Nets. And um, Dylan and Chris, you guys saw them in yesterday's vlog, I think it was. They're gonna be meeting me there. Gordy couldn't make it, he was in a meeting or something like that. So I had extra tickets, so I just invited them. Guys, I made it, I'm here waiting for Dylan and Chris.
decided to join me, beat LA traffic. Kobe, attack. Kobe. Yo, is Kobe playing tonight or what? Dude, Kobe and Shaq are gonna kill it tonight. Kobe bro. and Shaq, they're killing, huh? Magic Johnson's coming back. <laughs> it's gonna be a sick game. Guys, I was sitting in there alone for like literally a whole quarter. And they put the whole camera on me and shit. They, they said loner, loner, loner. Damn. No, I'm kidding. They didn't do that. Ooh, dude, they got, I wonder if they have like the watermelon lemonade here. Ooh, was that, no, was that here? That was by the USC, actually. No, yeah, that wasn't here, but that shit was Damn. fire. Brought guys, food. Yeah, oh, yeah, I'm starving. I haven't ate. I waited for you guys to get food. Hey, you the but, guys, we legit, we went to a Shane O'Neill skate competition, and me and Dylan literally got addicted to this lemonade. It was like a watermelon lemonade. It was legit made of, like, real watermelon. It was all crushed up and shit in it, and we've been craving it ever since, and we can't find it anywhere. I think I best. don't think it's here, homie. The best drink I've ever had. Maybe I, it probably beats the hibiscus lemonade from Cheesecake. Ooh, that was fire. Homie, this is the VIP entrance. Oh, I feel cool. Hell yeah. I feel cool. I'm not used to getting by the VIP. <laughs> That's crazy. We were just talking about, like, imagine they had, like, the caught champs here or something like that. And I guess they've already had like League of Legends tournaments and stuff here. And also next, um, this weekend actually in Oakland, it's at the Oracle I Center. I am, it's where the um, Warriors play and stuff, which is pretty cool. Yo, how close am I from hitting my head on this? <laughs> Yo, was that close? That was Yo, record really close. this? Dude, you're like, you're like in this. Dude, I this. Oh, I'm hitting that, dude. 100%. Hit <laughs> What'd you get, homie? Got the SoCal burger. SoCal, that's me. Thank you. Order 10 burgers. SoCal burger. Order number 13. Thank you. Yo, you ready to watch this hockey game or what? I'm ready to watch this football game, bro. Football game, hell yeah. SoCal burger. Football game. What? Should I check the ticket? Yeah, no, I know where it is right here. Ooh, some shit went down. Some shit's going down, Dylan. Some shit's going down. All right, guys, so it's half time right now. I'm still here chilling with Dylan and Chris. So, guys, one of the people that we work with in phase, um, I guess he's at the game, and uh, he came up to me, and he texted me saying that he has something for me, a surprise, and this is it. I got invited to, like, the family room of the Lakers or something like that, which is pretty cool. This ticket looks pretty cool. All right, guys, so I invited Chris right here last minute, and he just told me that he's like a die-hard Lakers fan, and this is his first ever game. So that's dope that I got to make that happen for him. Dude, that's so sick. I really appreciate it. Hell yeah, bro. That's awesome. You know that? What? This is his first Laker game. game. Wait, what? No way. Dude, I've never been to a football or basketball game until now. What? That's crazy, bro. Damn, I just brought both of these guys to their first and Lakers we're from game. SoCal. Yeah, I'm not even from here. I'm from Canada. Yeah, cool. And you guys are from around here. What? I'm busy. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, this fool's busy grinding busy for champs. Dreaming, man. <laughs> I don't got no time to go to no Lakers. <laughs> this is dope, though. They're winning right now, guys. Again, huge shout out to SeatGeek for hooking up with these seats. I'm gonna explain to you guys basically what SeatGeek is. Hey guys, so before this vlog continues, I just wanna quickly show you guys how SeatGeek works and actually what SeatGeek is. And also I wanna thank them for getting me these tickets. So basically guys, what happens with SeatGeek is that they gather tickets from around the internet and stuff and um, they get you the best deals for the seats to any type of event that you want. So it could be like a sporting event, a concert, anything in that sense. And then basically what they do is they rate the tickets zero to 100. All the green that you're gonna be seeing is all the best deals and the red being the worst. And guys, before I forget, I also have a code that you can use. It's just code Nico and you can get 20 bucks back on your first purchase. So all the information that you guys will need to get the app and to sign up will be in the description below. Again, thank you so much to SeatGeek for hooking me up with these tickets. The game was awesome. It was just a really good experience. I love being there. So thank you guys. All right, guys. Well, I was about to say the Lakers were on a little streak right there, but they just missed. This camera actually has ridiculously good zoom. Bro, that dude can shoot. That's three in a row. Three in a row by that tall monster right there. And he's a center. And he's hitting threes. Let's go. What do you guys think? Is this going in or not? Fade away, boy. Ooh, look at that pass. Foul. Yo, know, guys, I need to show you something. I'm not sure why, but... In the Staples Center, they have everything sports related. And then they have a random Taylor Swift sign that says most sold out performances. 
Thanks for letting us know, Staples Center. Oh, what was that? What do you mean so close? That was terrible. That was awful, dude. Let's see if you can hit a tray. That was terrible. Huh? Oh, dude. Guys, Dylan is that one kid you never want to come to a game with because he always just gets up. I need food, bro. He got chili cheese fries and he forgot a fork. I'm never letting you up again. That's it. If you got to pee, you're never. You have to pee in a bottle right there. You're not getting up. Guys, here are the daily struggles of being a giant. You can barely fit in the seats at the Staples Center. My Ooh, this guy's gonna kill it. Let's see. Oh, damn. He just got blocked. Boom. I saw no foul. I saw no foul. I saw a clean block. That was crazy. That is game. Oh shit. What? That is dope. And Lakers take the W. That's game. Alright guys, like I said, our manager hooked us up with this ticket. I'm not sure where I'm going or what it's for, but this is what he gave me, so hopefully they let me through here. What's good, man? Family room, one second. Okay, oh, it says family slash green room. Family room, family room. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. All right, cool. Thanks, man. I think I'm supposed to go to like the floor or something. I'm not sure. All right, guys, so I'm here in this. What is this place called, Eric? Uh, chairman's room. I am in the chairman's room at the Staples Center, which is pretty cool. I guess this is what this ticket brought me a bunch of like owners and stuff coming to this area and we actually just walked by Jeremy Lim which was pretty cool but I'm gonna try and ski my way to the court it's pretty loud in here I don't even know if you guys can hear me but I'm gonna see if I can get on the court and try to vlog it I'm pretty good at scheming I skied my way to the Travis Scott concert all the way to the front alright guys well I got home pretty late last night from the game the traffic was so bad and I was so tired I was actually falling asleep in my uber the game was absolutely amazing I had so much fun and to top the game off I got to go downstairs and hang out in the chairman's room that's where like a bunch of the owners and stuff go and I also like randomly walked past Jeremy Lin which was pretty cool he was injured and he wasn't playing and another thing that I thought was pretty cool was Chris and Dylan have never been to a Lakers game and Chris is like a huge Lakers fan so it was pretty cool that I got to take them to their first game they absolutely loved it they couldn't stop thank I am so excited Tico is coming in a few hours he's gonna be here soon we're gonna make a ton of videos we're gonna do a bunch of stuff together it's gonna be a lot of fun I haven't seen Tico in a long time and I miss him thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed if you did please smash that like button and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video banana I'm on a new level. I'm on a new level. I'm on a new level.